Hello and welcome to this short video presentation. Today I will show how to use ClearSight Analyzer and its powerful combined flow feature to deeply analyze what is the end user experience or I should say his own client PC experience to simply browse and display a website front page. So here I have ClearSight Analyzer opened in the real-time monitoring screen. So let's browse google.fr for this purpose. Now I will go back to ClearSight Analyzer screen and see that I have some DNS and some HTTP traffic. If I go to the detail, I will see that my DNS queries were hopefully related to the Google domain as well as for the HTTP traffic. In order to deeply analyze and understand what are all the steps that had to be followed by my internet browser to get all the elements of the page and actually display it once assembled, I will go to Combine Flows and create a new Combine Flow, which I will name Google. I select it and I go back to the Details tab, where I will actually add all these specific flows, DNS queries included, to my Combine Flow. And the last one. Here we go. Let's go back to Combine Flow. If I look at the top of this window, I will see my Combine Flow, and if I drill down, I will see all my individual flows that I just have manually added to it. So I can here below see all my individual flows sequentially. But if I click on the Google top level, Combine Flow, I will see, time-wise, all the steps that were made by my internet browser to get this page displayed. And one of the first things he made is basically a DNS query to get the IP address of the google.fr website. Once he got the IP address, he could establish a connection to it. And so on and so on. And I can see here that basically he's doing four concurrent sessions or connections to the website to actually download separate elements to get all the page displayed. I can even see that he has to go to another server to get specific elements like the generate 204 here which most probably was listed as an element to get from the source HTML file. Okay, what we can see also is the timestamps, and I should say more even important, the delta time between each element of the discussion. Hope you did find this short video useful. Thank you very much for your time, and talk to you soon. Bye-bye.